a useful and effective method for revision is the use of flashcards. This can be done in the traditional method using ordinary paper or card, or an alternative way is by using Microsoft Education Labs flashcards. This is a website, and in order to access the flashcards, you will need a Hotmail user account. Once you've logged in, it's simple to create your own flashcards. Here's some I've created earlier. Um, this one is chemistry, C 2.1 on structure and bonding. So to create your flashcards, all you simply do is type in the keyword or the question on the left hand side, on the right hand side, the answer. You can use text, audio, or you can insert an image from a file. If we go down, we can then start to create the next flashcards. So all we do is simply type in the question, such as what charge will the group six elements form? The answer of course being minus two. Once you're happy and you've created all your cards, you then type in the title, click the category, and then save the changes. You can then study your flashcards. This is done in three methods. The first one is to review all the keywords and the questions. This simply gives you on the left hand side the keyword or the question, and on the right hand side the answer. So scrolling through, you have an iron, it's a charged atom, a cation is a positive ion, an anion is a negative ion, and so on. The second method is to study the flashcards. This then just shows you the key word or the question. Um, so I'm testing myself, I think an iron is a charged atom. When you flip the card over, it reveals the answer. If you had this correct, you can tick it, or if not, cross it. So I got it correct, and I wore myself a tick. So next one, what charge will the group one elements form? Again, you can flip the card over to reveal the answer, or the third method is to type it in. So a box appears below for your answer. So the charge that the group elements will form, I think is plus one. This they will mark it for you. So check the answer, and again, had it correct. Um, the top section here will then give you feedback, a report of your flashcards. And there we go, it shows you I've had two cards, both of them correct. So this part, I'm free to print it out, or I'm going back and improve my score. It also gives you a time for your score, so you can see your percentage score and how long it took you to get all the questions correct or finish that session. And this is Microsoft Education Labs flashcards.